The strength behind your survival is not your effort. It is God. He showed mercy to whom he pleases him. Don't tell me because I work hard. No! You must return the glory back to him. One day God asked me, he said, most times we say we don't have, we are not blessed. Calculate what you used to sustain, what God used to sustain you in a year. You ask yourself, how did I make this money? What the food you ate, the clothes, the water, the school fees, all your bills. Can you calculate? You know they, you know they, but yes, he did. <laughs> Anyama bu o awu o ole bu begi chineke Himela Himela o kaka Anyama you know there's some sickness that is expensive that can finish a man's worth even though you have money and God didn't allow salt to come upon you and there are many things you saw this year but the Lord saw you through what a mighty God Come and do what only you can do. Jehovah, you are a faithful God. Jehovah, you are a righteous God. Jehovah. He's a faithful God. God who promises and never changes his mind. Human being does not make him to hate you. He doesn't call it pride. Thank him. Wave those hands wherever you are telling Lord, thank you. You are a faithful God. You are a consuming fire. You are a consuming fire. Look at this, Psalm chapter 8 verse 4. Let's see what Psalm 8 verse 4 says. Psalm 8 verse 4. Can we read together? What is man? That thou art mindful of him. The son of man that thou visitest. Verse 5. Look at what he said. For thou hast made him a little lower than angels and hast crowned him with glory and honor. We are nothing. Gini kamandu punua na chuku ne le kota manya. Gini kamandu punua na chuku na sopuru mo. Gini kambo haja kambo Na chuku nele kota manya Gini kamado ponoa Na chuku nele tamo The Bible says, what is man? We are nothing but he loves us. Now let me tell you, if it's by holiness and righteousness for we to live, many of us find this qualified. Look at the book of Job chapter 15. Verse 15 and 16. When I read that scripture, I felt I don't know, but let's look at it. Job 15, 15 and 16. Job. Behold, he put no trust in his side. Yea, the heavens are not clean in his side. How much more abominable and filthy is man which drinketh iniquity like water. How much more if you look at it from verse 14, there's a statement from that verse 14. He said, what is man that thou should be clean? And which, that which is born of a woman that thou should be righteous. He now had to let us know that he put no trust in his sense. Because even the heavens are not clean. How much more filthy and abominable. That is man that, the Bible says, would drink iniquity like water.
Lord, you are more precious than silver. Lord, you are more costly than gold. Lord, you are more beautiful than diamond. There is nothing I desire compared with it. We are not qualified, men and brethren. But I want you to be grateful. No matter what has come around you, but look at it that God is still good. Don't ever use your mouth ask God, what have you done for me? Your life alone, your life. I've seen some people who use 10 million to take care of their self. They didn't have the money and yet they didn't survive. But God never allows such sickness to come upon us. You hear the sound of my voice, even though you are sick in your body. Thank God that sickness has not taken your life. Even though you went through anything. But thank God. Ecclesiastes chapter 9 verse 1 said to him that is found among the living. There is still hope. Great is thy faithfulness. Great is thy faithfulness. Morning by morning. New mercy I see. Oh, that I need. That your hands has provided. Great is the faithfulness, Lord, unto me. Hear me, even if people talk about you, there are people who narrate you. Let it not bother you. As long as you're alive, everybody will talk. Huh? If they don't talk about you, show you are nobody. So for them to talk about you, you are somebody. So relax your mind. Jineme mabonyo bioma. I wish you can join me out there. My viewers all over the world are wanting to join me. If you cannot come, you can join me on live broadcast. And I believe the Lord will bless you. 6 o'clock in the morning, 7.30 in the morning, and 8.30. The venue is Wisdom Cathedral 21 Bank Relay by Writer Hotel, Back of Global Hotel, or Pamishan Road, Bini City, Ajo State, Nigeria. Then 8 o'clock to 9 o'clock, and then 10 o'clock to 12 o'clock, which I am going to worship God specially. So join me at the fifth service, 10 o'clock to 12 o'clock in the afternoon at International Worship Center, Wonderland Prayer City, kilometer 12 o'clock, Benina Boru, by RCC Junction before bypass the Benino Quarters, Ibuba Hill, Benin City, a state Nigeria. Maybe you want to still come here yeah, a little bit closer to those things. You can join. We have accommodation within the International Worship Center inside the compound. We have a driver camp. We have a very good accommodation where you can stay and stay as long as you want to stay. We have 24 hour security and there is light. You can join me online. Distance is not a barrier. I see grace extending where you are and I see the Lord turning your story into glory. God bless you.